viewing consumer back. All right, so here we are. Let's open this up. This is a flashlight by Rayo. It says military grade aluminum alloy LED flashlight. Sorry, I know that's loud opening that pack up. Waterproof, 1200 lumens, lithium ion battery, uh, 500 meter range, five light modes, and again, it is aluminum alloy. We open it up. What do we have? We got boom, charger, boom, flashlight, and two batteries. Uh, this case, in case you're wondering, is uh, pretty light plastic. It's uh, it's not metal or anything. It's so it's pretty cool. All right, so pull a flashlight out. See what we got. Uh, let's see, telescopic. All right. Well, let's pull it back right here. There it is. In fact, yeah, that's pretty pretty nice. This is uh for triple A's. You can put triple A batteries in here in place of your uh, uh, what cover kind these are, I'm not sure what kind they are. They don't have any uh, numbers on them or anything like that. This is a relatively new company, but I'm uh, I'm cool with trying out new products, obviously. Oh, there it is, it is bright. It's really bright. All right. So we got two batteries and we have another backup here with the AAAs like I said before. So one of the things pretty cool about this light is you can see the light pattern. It's a square like this. I can open it up telescopic and bring it right on down to the actual square of the LED, which looks pretty cool. Uh, we'll try it at a little longer distance and see what we get. All right, so I'm outside. Get the light on. I'm just going to zoom it right in. It's got that square beam. It's pretty cool looking actually at a distance. That's uh, that gate that we're looking at right there is probably 40 feet away. Climbing on up, I and mean, we could shine the trees and everything at this. I mean, this this light is it's bright. There's no doubt about it. It's brighter than I thought it was looking at it inside. I mean, you can see how bright it is on the grass. But I mean, we can let's see if we can pan up a little bit to the trees. We can go right on up with it the very top of the trees right there. I can clearly see um, what I'm looking at. Let's see if we can back it off a little. Let's try to open it up. That was pretty cool. I mean, I was kind of wasn't a big fan of the square, but uh, I don't know, it looks pretty awesome. It's pretty cool now. This is a bright flashlight. All right, so we're gonna go through the different modes. This is the brightest mode. Is the next one dimmer strobe and this is like an SOS strobe and then back to high so there they are we'll cycle through them again and back to high all right so a couple things I didn't uh didn't touch on, didn't really look at the charger, wall charger, flip it out, it uh, folds away, it's good, it actually does both at the same time, take both your batteries, again, this does take triple A's, uh, which is a good backup, you can also get rechargeable triple A's, so you don't actually have to buy batteries for this, between these two, you probably won't even use this, unless these batteries, um, you know, forget to charge them or something, you'll still have another backup, uh, pulling this back out, something that I uh, I didn't mention was putting this sleeve on there. I noticed that um, you can put this sleeve on there and it actually makes the battery fit a little bit better in the flashlight itself. Another thing to take in mind when you're charging it is, is they're not real clearly marked, but this is the negative side. This is the positive post of the battery. You can see there's just a little bit of indention up there to kind of give you that. But when you put the battery in, you want to make sure that you know you get the correct polarization and you'll see you know it'll light up green. So all right, plug this in, charge it up. This will turn uh, green when it's done, red when it needs to be charged, or red while it's charging, excuse me. All right, so pros and cons of this flashlight. I uh, don't really have any cons to speak of. The two batteries are great. The double wall charger is great. The extra uh, AAA adapter is good. Flashlight's small. It's bright. Um, I don't have anything negative to say about it. But time will tell. I'll check it out, and if I find something else, I'll post that. Alright, so if you're interested in this flashlight, I have a link in the description below. It's the Rayo. 
It's a uh, 1200 lumens. It's got the microscopic lens. And it's, uh, it feels like a nice flashlight. It's got the tactical end on it. And uh, as always, thanks for watching. Uh, hit subscribe and hit that like button on your way out. Thanks.